Hello everybody, this is Legum Trump fan 123 and bring and I'm bringing you a new review of Ninja Go. Now this set is is called the Mountain Shrine. Um it's new. I got it today. It's really cool. I like it a lot. It's like probably one of my favorite Ninja Go in fact. And yeah, let's get started by the box. Now here, Lego Ninja Go Master Spin Jitsu. So you can see there's Kai, recommended ages, 7 to 14. Set number, 254. And the thing on the side, nothing special. It has a scale of the real scale. And here, the, the, the same thing, except that here they changed. And they put in the person that comes with it. So it comes as... Kai DX. And then here the scent number and the weapons that you have. I got number one and number two, but number two came in another series. School motorbike. And then here you got the functions. And then you can do now I open this way because I don't like opening this way. Because this makes it more like organized, you know. Now on to the instructions. Um if I'm doing it quick, I'm sorry because I have to do this quick because um, before I, tr I I've been trying to do reviews like of this one like tryouts and it t and I took 22 minutes and in YouTube you can't do more than 15 but anyways Lego Ninja Go Kai set number two to do 54 and then it's got the many figures you can know you don't need to know how much steps it takes but to build like the temple thing it takes 29 steps fitting. And the other part, um, eight steps of fitting, and it has probably like 48 steps of fitting overall, like 48 pages of fitting, like where you fit. And then you got the other pieces, and you got the other sets advertising for them. Um, I really want this one. Like this one right there, and this one, the bigger one. But I'm not gonna get it, that's for sure. Well, I might get the small, but anyways. Here, um, if you're wondering why this set is part of these collections, um, that is because it's like they're training. And there you get all the weapons where it comes with. Then advertising, ninjago.com, the game, Lego Club, and the new thing in 2012. Ninja Go. Maybe it's gonna end or not. I do not know. Maybe there's a new thing. And now we will start the review. But first, we'll. with the mini figures and stuff. And so here's Kai. I love him. Like, not love, like, kissing him. So, so I just love how he's designed. Now, his sword. Let's zoom in. It is really cool. Now, it's got a dragon on it, and then it's blowing fire out. Now, like, the original katana swords are not like this. They are, like, um, one centimeter sh shorter, I'm going to say, something like that. But anyways, moving on, you get this piece. Pretty normal. The head is kind of cool. It's pretty cool, I think, for many figures. It's eyes and it's frowning. He's mad and he got scratches because you don't see it. You don't see it, so. Here it says Kai and here are the flame. And then here it's got dragon blowing fire. It has um, a belt and golden, which makes them really cool. I love the design. Um, now I'm gonna put everything, um, we'll zoom out, I know. Now, um, I'm gonna check out those, like, Beyblade things, so you kind of, like, have to twist it yourself, see. And, um, over here, it's got, f uh, like, a flame head that you saw in his back torso and he's got fire flames back in the detail and it's golden and red 
and you can connect it and these are very delicate because they can go out easily so you can put him like that and he's ready for battle and now on to his training like a skeleton guy now they haven't used his body this body for years and it's a new color pretty cool and his arm is lovely so it's like example it feels a dead I'm going to take an example of our Indian guy. Like if he was a dead man and he had a weapon with him. So basically it would be wobbly. And it's because of the gravity. You know that reason. And it's a new color and you got a stud brick. So that's cool. And then now we are going to show you, well I am going to show you the, a demonstration of how Kydex hits that skeleton. So here is the example of how it works. Okay, skeleton you will die and you Kai you won't die because you are you are our dear example now. All you do is you gotta twist it like that. Okay. So, three, two, one, ninja go. That is actually me who hit it, so. Cheating, I'm a cheater, haha. -ha. Ah. It should hit. Okay, that was the example. Okay, so that was the example of those two, and now we're gonna move on. Um, here's like this razor blade thing, so it's pretty cool. You can twist. They got these like ninja stars but it's we use of these axe pieces I and mean, it's a really dark metal they rotate and this is like really quick to build like it's nothing special this is the hardest part to build and this is the easy part and then for some reason they got they added this thing which i think is kind of bad well i'm wondering what it's for i think i know i'm not too sure but uh, and you got a leaf there and now on the ultimate the set thing. Now, here it is. And I also forgot to add the other things that are annoying. Now, the most annoying thing is these. This is the uh, two shield of Stronis and Hauki, Tomari Hauki, that they brought back. So that's interesting. And add them together like that, and they make a ball, and then this thing. And what is disappointing is that these fall off, you know? You can just push them off and that's the only thing disappointing, but anyways. These, like, bars rotate 105 no, 185 or something, I don't know. Well, it could be 190 degrees because this is basically, you know, this is 180 and this is, like, 190 or something. And you can hook them up. I'm gonna take them off. And you got this treasure chest with two plates, one by two gold. And that's interesting because they brought those back from the agents theme. I actually have one that I destroyed. And one right there that I destroyed too. That one didn't come with it. You know, even the second one. Never had any other ones in the first and the second. But anyways, um, rock parts. And then you got these flags that do rotate then you got this flag here with a Chinese sign I do not know what that means do not ask me but I'm sure someone in Japanese or in Chinese can read then you got these flames and you can take these out yes you can and um, here on this side you can, you, you can put a chain you, you get a chain and on this side, you get a really cool weapon now. To make it not look like a Grim Reaper weapon, they just added another one of these, which is two pieces. And they did the opposite. So that's pretty cool. Especially when you're using it as a ninja go. On a ninja go. And um, I think there's holes here because you're meant to stick that. I'm going to try... Yeah, it does work, but it doesn't, like, 
fit because it should be somewhere close. And yes, um, I hate it when this happens. Like, technique parts sometimes are really annoying. Anyways, um, you get also get new pieces. Now, these new pieces I do not like. Well, they are cool, but they're not the best. Um, you get these, like, big bars with rods here and with more detail, like Chinese. And that is interesting. Um, on the top you get kind of like the Chinese things. And you get, like, a scorpion sign. So that's pretty cool. And then here you can put a tre treasure, a treasure chest. And then you can close it up. Like putting in your box, which you actually cannot, well, unless if you break it. And that's pretty much it. I mean, there's not that much to say about it because it's pretty small. And in dollars, probably 19. And in euros, 14, I think. Because they may cost in different prices in different stores. But I got mine at 14. Heroes Online, I think. Yes. Online. Um, so, yeah. That's pretty much it about my review. And if you like my reviews, please rate, comment, subscribe, and goodbye.